types of tumors the types of tumors we have carcinoma carcinoma so this is cancer in the epithelial or epidermal tissues so when we have in our body epithelial that is outer and epidermal that is the dermal tissues the outer layers again and we can see there we can see cancers in the case of skin mucous membrane which is there inside the respiratory tract anal tract digestive tract all these regions and glands lungs breast pancreas and stomach when cancer it is seen in the skin mucous membrane or uh, the glands the lungs the breast the pancreas and the stomach we call it as carcinoma next is called sarcoma it is seen in connective tissues like bones and muscles and lymph node that we called as sarcoma that is called as sarcoma and kaposis this is a secondary disease associated with aids if a person is having acquired immunodeficiency syndrome that is hiv infections you will develop this type of uh, secondary disease that is called as the kaposis that is also it is a cancerous type and leukemia leukemia is uncontrolled growth in wbcs you know wbc cells are the one which play an important role in defense mechanism so what will happen here and uh, because of this leukemia mainly because of uncontrolled wbc so what will happen here the wbc it infiltrate infiltrate it enters into the bone marrow cells spleen liver and lymph nodes and other organ causes increases in its size so all these spleen it 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 undergo the increase in size that's called splenomegaly that is enlargement of uh, spleen takes place enlargement of liver hepatomegaly lymph nodes and other organs it increases in size and similarly immature are it also affects the myeloid stem cells these are all the important uh, process that takes place in leukemia next is called as uh, adenoma this is cancerous of glands like salivary gland or any endocrine or exocrine gland is affected we call it as adenoma next type is called as lymphoma lymphoma is cancer in lymph nodes and spleen cancer in the lymph nodes and spleen we call it as lymphoma and uh, because of this what will happen excessive production of lymphocytes takes place lymphocyte production it will be more so lympho lymphocytes plays an important role uh, in production of antibody t lymphocytes and b lymphocytes what will happen here abnormal growth of t lymphocytes and b lymphocytes can takes place so that we call it as lymphoma so these are all different types of cancerous cells